Hello and welcome back to another video by Scene Through Cars. Today we are in the Netherlands. Well, I do not know where exactly we are, but I flew from Austria. No, I flew from Munich. This is in Germany to Amsterdam in the Netherlands. And I picked up this rental car, a Mini Cooper S automatic seven gears and under the hood there is a 180 horsepower strong engine i'm not sure but i think it is petrol so well this video might get a little shorter because I do not have my GoPro with me therefore I am filming with my mobile device and I'm not sure um, how the police in Netherlands in the Netherlands uh, is thinking about uh, yeah that well but of course I've got someone who's holding my mobile phone so uh, this car has only about uh, 3,000 kilometers on the clock and therefore everything is new it feels good the steering wheel is really cool it is like BMW steering wheel well surprise surprise it is the same I think but mm, nonetheless BMW knows how to produce steering wheels in front of me you can see there is a head-up display but it's not uh, this what you expect in a premium car but we aren't in the premium car here therefore it is all right but it's just a screen coming over or coming out of the front here and then you see everything over there but it is a good quality so I cannot complain about that to the middle screen well the layout I hate those mini layouts those knobs and stuff although of course they look cool but I hate this round circle in the middle well what should that be come on guys but that's what a mini makes of the roof we got a sunroof this is really cool it is bright inside and it's easy to control over here and yeah that's cool I really like that in here although this car is really small in comparison to other cars we already drove on this channel I, I somehow like it like to the front it looks big and like a 5 series because you sit low seating position is really low you're sitting near to the ground and therefore the hood uh, appears big and long to you because you, you 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 cannot really see what what is in front of you and that yeah makes it somehow bigger if you look to the back it is like yeah then you know that it is a small car but it is the, the overview and the visibility is really great due to that so somehow I like this car but only somehow only driving wise and visibility wise then we got a, a nice gearbox as I already mentioned a 7 speed and of course due to the fact that it is a Mini Cooper S it sounds a bit funnier and you can make this car make get you feeling like you're in a sports car like manual third gear and so 
it's a little, little bit of sound but yeah of course this is not a Ferrari it is not it's a Mini Cooper and that's well I do not know oh there was a pretty girl in this car uh, I do not know how much those things cost but I would say it costs about uh, 30,000 euros and I think they are more expensive than that but buying those new for 30,000 euros it is totally worth it equipped with that stuff you got Apple CarPlay over here the newest one with Bluetooth and everything you need some shifting pedals they feel a bit chunky because they're made of plastic and you feel that they're made of plastic but that's okay what else can I tell you yeah this digital uh, driving entertainment no not entertainment driving yeah do not I do not know how to call it but you know, this thing here it's digital and somehow it's small of course it has to be small otherwise you won't see through the steering wheel but I do not like the layout of that and yeah it's okay so what else can I say the mirrors the side mirrors are really big so as I already said, the visibility is great. And of course, you feel sporty in here. I've got leather seats and everything you want to drive along with. Well, I got so about 60 kilometers more to drive, and I think I will enjoy every one, every single one of them. So guys, uh, I'm sorry that the last video is long ago, but the one who would supply it in the M4 to me uh, didn't do it in the end, so therefore this video will not come. I'm so sorry for that, but instead of course we have already had a Ferrari on this channel maybe I can provide some more maybe in one or two years and some Porsche the next video you will see after this one is a new Tesla Model Y I hope you are tuned for that because well that's some uh, some different stuff on this channel at the first EV and of course, as I said, it is new, therefore I am not the first one driving this car, but yeah, there aren't that many uh, YouTubers who can provide such a car. So I hope you enjoy this video as well. Here, something different, a mini, it's not what I normally like to test because it's not a real sports car but well I'm testing everything and every car so if you want your car to be driven guys the email address of my business account is under the video down in the description so send me a mail I will go to you I will travel to you I don't care where you live if it's America, China, Africa, everywhere in the world, you can offer me to drive your car. So now I will stop this review. I can tell you this car is cool, but the price has to be okay, otherwise, it's shit. Thanks for watching. Hit the bell on to get notified when a new upload and subscribe to my channel. Support me. Please leave a comment about what you think about my videos. And thanks. Have a good evening.